Dupatron's contracture is a common condition that affects the hand, causing them to gradually pull down and stuck in a bent position. The finger becomes constantly getting in the way. Dupatron often starts as a lump or nodule in the palm. As it progresses, a tight band or cord is formed, pulling the finger down sometimes all the way and become stuck in the hand. The finger stuck in the bent position can limit patient's functions such as putting gloves on. It also limits the hand span, making it difficult to grasp large objects. Dupatron tissue comes from the thick palmar fascia from the hand. Palmar fascia is a thick sheet that helps to anchor the skin while grasping. The palmar fascia continue to build up in Dupatron's contracture, becoming the nodule and cord that eventually pull the finger down. Dupatron is a genetic condition, particularly in North European descent. Other conditions such as alcoholism, diabetes, seizure medications, and smoking are also potential causes. Examination starts with inspection and palpation of the cord, in this case a central cord to the little finger, and other potential cords such as abductor cord. Next we check for Garrett's pads at the back of the PIP joint, a sign of a more aggressive form of the condition. To measure the degree of flexion deformity, we first put the finger at maximal stretch. From the back of the hand to the back of the finger, the degree of MCP joint flexion is 60 degrees. Similarly, the PIP joint flexion is 45 degrees. Lastly, the tabletop test, an excellent way for patient to self-monitor progression. Simply try to put hand flat on the table and see if the palm of the hand will reach flat on the surface. If you fail the tabletop test, it's time to consider the following treatments. The dupe trunk cord can be released in the clinic. A fine needle is used to carefully break the cord and to straighten the finger. This is done under local anesthetics. This treatment needs minimal recovery time, but has a high risk of recurrence. Enzyme called collagenase can also be injected into the Dupitron tissue to break the cord over a few days. The finger is then manipulated to straighten. Again, this requires minimal time to recover, but recurrence risk is high. Surgery to remove all Dupitron cord is the gold standard treatment. The correction often lasts a long time. The recovery, however, can be long with risk of finger stiffness, infection, and nerve injury. Here is an example of needle release done in the clinic. Thank you for watching, please comment below and subscribe.